Russia has signed a contract to supply an undetermined number of Orlan 10E reconnaissance drones to Myanmar as part of a deal that also includes the Panzer S-1 surface-to-air missile system and radar equipment. Russian defense systems, in particular the Panzer S-1 anti-aircraft system, are expected to be deployed in Myanmar's Shan state, which borders the WA self-governing zone controlled by the United WA State Army, Myanmar's largest ethnic armed organization. The deal was signed during a visit by Russian Defense Minister General Sergei Shaigu to Myanmar's capital Naypyidaw last week and marks Moscow's entry into the drone market. The Orland 10E has been in use in the Russian military since 2010 and is designed for reconnaissance and aerial surveillance from a maximum altitude of 6,000 meters. The drone can fly at a maximum speed of 70 miles per hour for up to 18 hours and can be controlled from a distance of about 90 miles, Forbes wrote. It is 1.8 meters long with a wingspan of 3.1 meters with a maximum takeoff weight of 18 kilograms including a payload of 4.5 kilograms. In its payload space, the drone can reportedly carry a wide variety of sensor options including daylight and thermal imaging cameras and 3D mapping equipment, as well as a laser pointer that can pinpoint the exact location of a weapon system. Myanmar is a longtime buyer of Russian defense equipment. Since 2001, the Southeast Asian nation has purchased 30 MiG-29 fighter jets, 12 Yak-130 trainer jets, 10 Mi-24 and Mi-35P helicopters, and 8 Pechora 2M anti-aircraft missile systems. In the same year, the two countries also signed an agreement allowing their respective naval vessels to enter their respective ports. Last year, the Myanmar army took part in joint military exercises in Russia, which also included defense personnel from Armenia, Belarus, Iran, Pakistan and China. Naypyidaw, once a heavy buyer of Western defense equipment, has grown closer to Moscow and Beijing since Western countries imposed sanctions on the country after a 1988 military coup.